today we're talking shorts also i'm really working on my background we got a new coffee table so that's our old coffee table i just stuck it in here because i don't know what i'm gonna do with it but i saw on i think it's rach loves life um she has like this really cute credenza thing or yeah just like a credenza and then it's really simple like fake plant on one side and some vases on the other and like really cute artwork i want to do something like that over there so i'm working on it but it's not done yet so bear with me i'm gonna have like a really yellow background for a little bit any hoozle today i am really excited about this video actually because I love wearing shorts. I don't love wearing shorts out in public because I have very prominent cellulite that I'm very self self conscious about. Um, I know I shouldn't be, but something I kind of got to work with. Um, so I always feel like when I see people in shorts, when I see people talking about shorts, they already have like really good bodies and it's just I haven't found somebody with my body type talking about shorts so I wanted to fill that gap today I do have different categories I'll explain why they're my favorite short and for what I do wear different shorts for different things um but yeah let's just hop right into it okay so first off these are my absolute favorite like sleep lounge wear around the house shorts and it is the skims sleep collection I love this collection. I have two pairs of the pants. I don't have any of the tanks or t-shirts. I really want to get some more. I, I am obsessed with skims. These do have like an elastic waistband. I did go one size. Oh no, I, these are my actual size medium, which is very surprising. So yeah, these are medium. And the waistband is, it's got that elastic in it. And then inside it does have like a little tie where you can also tighten it a little bit more. But the way, like where these hit me, the way that they fit, they breathe, like I am just obsessed with these. If you want like a really good pair of sleep shorts or just like lounge shorts, I highly recommend Skims. Honestly, anything from Skims, I think you're golden with, but the sleep collection specifically, I can speak for, and that is some of the best quality clothing I have ever put on my body. Okay, so these are my workout side, my around the yard kind of shorts i don't wear these for any sort of cardio or anything because it does show sweat but it is the balance athletica vista shorts so i did just get the buff bunny lifesaver shorts and i am obsessed with those those honestly would probably replace these if i didn't get such a bright color where i don't want it to get dirty but these i have darker colors so i can get these dirty all the time and no issues so i like having that um, I'm not going to say that these are my favorite pair of like quote unquote running shorts because a the waistband is pretty thick which for me I have like a very small space between my ribs and like hips so a big waistband like this it just it fits funny on me and then on the inside so it does have like the inside layer you are completely covered but this part right here is not as compressive as the buff bunny one and I really like a little bit of compression so they stay put a little bit better these do ride up right away they will ride up um, there's no pocket the buff bunny ones do have pockets the only reason I'm not don't have the buff bunny ones right now is because I worked in the yard yesterday and they are extremely dirty so that's why I don't have them right now but these are also a good staple because I know that the buff bunny lifesaver shorts aren't gonna be as available as the Vista from balance so Good alternative, but if you can get your hands on the Lifesaver shorts, I would recommend those over these. Okay, so these are shorter shorts, not super short. Um, but I picked these specifically because this pattern makes the bum look so good. Also, these are a good like short short option that I have personally tried. I do want to disclose that I have worked for Balance, so I do have a lot of balance forward clothes um that's a lot of the athletic wear athleisure wear that i have tried i am obviously trying to venture into new companies but it's going to take a little bit of time for me to kind of build up like a perfect one but 
these boa pr print shorts. I don't know if they're coming back. I don't know what the deal is with the Kingdom collection, but these boa shorts, I, w I meant to get them in rider short, but I did get end up getting them in the shorter short, which is fine. I don't mind. I just wear them around the house. But this print, it makes, it makes the bum look so good. So if you just want like a staple pair of shorts where you know you're going to put them on, you're going to feel like that girl and your bum is going to look great, this print specifically is a must. Okay, so I have been getting a lot of navigation and I really like it. Um, I'm not huge on their like seamless stuff. I just think I personally don't like seamless as much. So my favorite pair of shorts from navigation and honestly they're kind of creeping into just like my overall favorite pair of shorts are the signature shorts so they do have like obviously the stitching around the waist they do have like just a seam no scrunching nothing like that no front seam they are a little bit longer they i believe they only have one length um so they are a little bit longer but that gives you more room to scrunch it adjust do whatever you want with these and I just feel like when I put these on, they don't cup my legs or like cinch my my thighs. And they just don't make me feel like a sausage, which I really like. And then I also like the waistband because it it's not, I mean, it's contoured a little bit to come in, but it's not going to like cut into your waist at all. So I've really, really been liking these um, from Navigation. I would recommend the Signature 2.0 shorts very much. I did just pick up the Pacific Blue from their launch and I'm really excited to try those. I will do a try on haul. Okay, so in honor of Miss Whitney coming back with a V4 and I I want to get everything guys. It's, it's an issue, but these are her rider shorts from her last collection. This is in the color Eucalyptus. I am obsessed with this color. I am obsessed with these shorts. I think that these are some of the most day-to-day -day flattering shorts ever. Um, I want to say that I sized up to a large in these. I will say that they Whitney's collection does fit a little bit small. So if you are in between sizes, I know she says like don't size up, but I personally have found that I need to size up. Otherwise I can't fit or I rip the seams. So. I do need to size up. Keep that in mind when shopping her collection. That's just my experience that I have had. But the little gold bar detailing here is so, so, so cute. The double stitching on the waistline really does something for your waist. And I think that's why I like these so much because it does go in, but it doesn't cut you. The double, um, double seam up here, the slightest booty scrunch like just the slightest. You can see it when I don't have them on, but when I put them on, it stretches it out and you can't see anything. And the nice thing about this scrunch is it's a flat lock. So it's not going to dig in. It's going to be right flat up against you. And the length, again, these are perfect because they're a little bit longer, but you can like scrunch them up and make them fit however you want. And I, I'm obsessed with these. Okay, so these are the Whitney shorts. I do have them pulled all the way down right now so you can see the full length. And now, I'm going to make them look the way that I want them to look. Gotta do a little maneuvering. So when I said that I have a very small, like, rib to waist ratio, I always get this little rolling right here. And it's because my ribs are like right here, and my hips are right here. So that's all the room that I have. Um, so they are gonna roll on me specifically, but that's just a me problem. So do keep that in mind. So if you are planning to buy from the Whitney collection, um, this is exactly what the shorts are going to look like, just in different colors. So this gives you a good representation. I just think that like with the gold bar detailing, all the little details make these shorts 
just feel like they go that little bit extra mile and I'm obsessed with them. So it'll be interesting to see how many pairs I get. Okay, so I know that I've shown these shorts on my channel before, but obviously we're doing a compilation of my favorite shorts. So these are the Navigation Signature 2.0 shorts in the color Olive. I have not adjusted anything. I just put them on. I'm not posing so you can see exactly how they fit. They do go down. Not quite as far as the Whitney ones, but they do go down, obviously, a little bit longer than short shorts. So I like them about there. I will say that the waistband is a little bit shorter here, so I don't have as much rolling as I did on the Whitney shorts. I just, I really like the way that these look on my specific body. And then I do like how the back it goes up higher than the front it feels so you can really get that like booty coverage and really just like get it up the crack you know okay so these are for my shorty short gals these are significantly shorter you still have like some room to pull them up if you wanted to but truthfully I would just gravitate towards the writer short because you can kind of adjust the length it just I don't know if it's picking up in camera, but it does just make your booty pop. Like it just looks really good. And I think that these are really good short, short recommendations just because like I said, they're not like super short. And then if you notice, they go up out the out, up at the outside and they kind of like go in. So it's gonna help give your leg a little bit more shape. And obviously I still have it pulled up to the bottom of my ribs and then I just get like that little teeniest bit of rolling, which I just do preemptively. I'm gonna say right off the bat, these are not the most flattering shorts. When I put my legs together, it feels like I'm wearing a diaper or something and I can't figure out how to stand unless it's like this to make the shorts look normal. So that's why I kind of keep them inside. They are cute, they do go down, like the outer shell, it does go down a little bit lower than the inner shell. Like I said, this is not compressive, it's just gonna be like a layer of protection. And obviously the, the thick waistband, but what I do like about this waistband is it doesn't come up to my ribs. So it's sitting right underneath, so I don't actually get as much rolling as I do in the other shorts. But I would still prefer the Lifesaver shorts over these, strictly due to the inner lining, the pocket, and the way that they fall is much better than this. So if you want just like some good outdoor double layer shorts, I recommend these. I don't recommend these for like walking or running or cardio or anything because you will sweat through. I have learned that the hard way. And last but certainly, certainly not least are the Skims Sleep Shorts. So like I said before, I did get these in a medium. Honestly, I would probably prefer them in a large just because the like inner part of it came out while I was doing this. It's interesting. Um, but I would probably go up strictly because I have thick thighs and they have saved lives and they just need a little bit more room to breathe honestly but I'm not mad at them so I do still have like a little bit hanging when I don't fully flex but these are so comfortable like just the fabric alone is worth it I love these shorts they are so dang comfortable it does accentuate my pooch a little bit but we gave up on trying to hide that. So that is my favorite shorts haul for right now. I hope that you guys got something from this video. I hope that if you are struggling with your own body image or cellulite or anything that makes you uncomfortable, I hope that this video makes you feel a little bit better um, knowing that I have intense cellulite um, and we are all beautiful the way that we are. 
and you are beautiful the way that you are and I appreciate you and I'm so happy that you're here. And if you have not already, please don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, share the video. It really helps the algorithm, really helps my channel, helps me grow. I would really appreciate it. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.